How's it going everybody? Dato Doi here, and in today's video we're not going to be talking about Dragon Ball Fighters or any other Dragon Ball games for that matter. We're actually going to be doing something a little different and covering this poster for the soon to be released Dragon Ball movie. Uh, this isn't something I normally do like I said, but I mean, are you kidding me? Dragon Ball Super Broly? He's coming back? Now I know this is going to be news that definitely splits the fan base a little. Broly is a very polarizing character to say the least, uh, but you either love him because he's, you know, dumb, just a powerhouse, and he, uh, you know, really capitalizes on that avenue of Dragon Ball, which is the fights, or you hate him because he represents the worst parts of Dragon Ball for you, which is just the rage and the fights and really not a lot of character there. Now even though I myself am not the biggest fan of Broly, this poster excites me a lot. Because I don't know, it feels like it should really be bringing two aisles together, because Broly fans are going to get even more Broly, which you know, it's something big for them, and he, he should become canon with this uh, movie, if you want to put it that way. And then for the people that really despise Broly, uh, you know, he's he could become a whole new character in this film. Uh, I don't think Goku and Vegeta are going into this knowing who Broly is. Uh, this is going to be a fresh introduction to him in the series, with the only people really having any thoughts on him being the fans. So this might be the one chance for Broly to become a fleshed out character more than just his hatred of Goku, and I think that's something people should be excited for. Another reason this poster excites me personally so much is because it's an indication that they're going to continue doing something that I really appreciated about Super, and that's building on the franchise instead of uh, starting from the middle. For example, over the course of Super's run, we got to see multiple looks of Saiyans uh, going into different forms when they're enraged, and before Super we just thought that was something unique to Broly because he was the legendary Super Saiyan, uh, but Super has shown us that Kale can obtain such a form, and Trunks also tapped into a rage form, pseudo where his eyes glazed over white, and this movie very could well be this payoff to all of those moments. Maybe Broly has some information to share on the transformation of Saiyans and tapping into rage, something like that. There are multiple avenues they could go with this in order to build on past events we've seen in the series so far. But even if the return of Broly doesn't really bring either of the two things I've mentioned so far, that being Broly comes back as a better, more in-depth character, or that we get some more information on Rage and Super Saiyans and how it affects their transformation, there is still a very good chance that this poster uh, confirms that they will be bringing back other non-canon characters and transforming them and tweaking them a little and making them fit into the main story. For example, what I mean is we've known for a long time that this is going to be a movie focusing around the Saiyans and the origins of the Saiyans, and we also recently got information that they're putting three remastered movies into theaters, uh, well movies, one of them is a, uh, you know, TV special, but still. Those three movies are the Broly movie, the Bardock TV special, and the Gogeta movie. Now what this Broly poster indicates to me is that Broly is coming back so they want to push and advertise Broly, and we also have Bardock in that lineup, which fits nicely with the Saiyan theme, does that mean that there is a small chance that Gogeta also has something to do with this new push? If so, I think a lot more fans are going to be appreciative of that, because I know unlike Broly, Gogeta mostly has fans, even a lot of people that like him more than Vegito. Still, even if Gogeta doesn't make a return at any point in the future, I'm still super excited that we're finally going to get a chance to have Broly become something more than just a basic rage character. I also really hope they tweak his backstory a little, not for nothing, but, you know, crying because Goku won't stop crying, it's kind of stupid. Either way, let me know your thoughts on the poster down below, whether or not you're excited for it, or you're just depressed that you're not going to get to see any new Saiyans like Yamoshi, or, or anything like that, just let me know your thoughts. While you're down in the comments, if you like this video and want to see more like this from this channel, make sure to hit the like button and subscribe. I'm Dato Doya, I'll see you in the next video.